Mind running it for us, Inspector? Not sure why you all were called in. We could handle it. Place belongs to Jason Sands, big ass political contributor. Been missing since last night. That's why we're here. Attorney General likes to stay on top of these kind of things. Mr. Sands' wife Jennifer arrived home last night with their daughter about nine o'clock. She found her husband gone, and this. Thanks, guys. There's been no ransom demand yet, but I expect we'll get something soon. If you want our tech guys to set taps, I gotta let them know. That's okay, we can handle it. Do you know where his family is? Uh, with friends. Mrs. Sands thought it would be best for the little girl, and we agreed. Any son of forced entry? No, must have been a front door job, someone posing as a courier or what have you. He's still here. <laughs> not unless he's invisible, he's not Agent Jane. He's not an agent, he's a consultant. No badge, no gun. They don't even give me dental. Oh, yeah. You're the one they were telling me about the psychic. Sorry, Gandalf, in our own bumbling way, we did look around pretty good. He's not here. He's here. And there's no such thing as psychics. He was tortured in this chair. To give them a passcode. Passcode to what? Could you humor me, Inspector? Could you try and pick up that sheet of paper? All right. Thanks. That's, that's it. Well, the bookcase must have moved. After these papers were spread all over the floor? It's the door. Too safe? Very safe, huh? Right? Yes. The intruder must have been distracted by something, left Sands alone for a moment. Sands punches in the code, and before they can stop him, goes into the safe room and shuts the door behind him. Which will open if you press the buttons a lot. <laughs> I'm entering the top ten passcode choices. But if it is a safe room, wouldn't it have a silent alarm connected to a security company? Not if you're the paranoid secretive type. You make a safe room only you know about. I guess we need a locksmith. Hang on a minute. Farewell and adieu to you, fair Spanish maidens. Farewell and adieu to you, ladies of Spain. For we've received orders for to sail back to Boston. And so never more shall we see you. Yeah.